As the North Korean crisis trumbles on, I begin to ask questions. I would want to know why we, that is the West, are pushing so strongly to prevent North Korea obtaining a nuclear weapon. I can see why geopolitically it destabilises the whole region. But when we then make that moralistic and then try to say that somehow it's something to do with some type of international regulation, this is why I have a problem. Let's make it absolutely clear. I'm not a fan of North Korea. Nor was I a fan of the previous regime in North Korea, or for that matter, the grandfather who ran it prior to uh, uh, um, the grandson, presently. However, the question is, can anybody, in fact I challenge anybody, to tell me what infringement North Korea has made against the NPT? North Korea, way back in, in the 90s, said that it wished to withdraw from the NPT. Again, back in 2003, it said it was going to withdraw from the NTP and give the necessary required notice and the necessary required timings. So what infringement is North Korea actually undertaking that warrants action against it by the United States? When one takes into account that the United States is monthly improving its nuclear arsenal and that we, the United Kingdom, say we need to improve ours. So how could it be wrong for somebody to try and begin to have an arsenal when we are saying we need to improve it? Now, again, I'm against proliferation of nuclear weapons. But being against that does not negate the fact that there needs to be an element of legality to any action taken to prevent the proliferation of nuclear weapons. Obtaining nuclear weapons to defend yourself, as we see it, we call it our nuclear deterrent, is in and itself not an offence. So please, can anybody tell me what North Korea are doing wrong and what the infringement is? And why then the United States feels it has a right to go to war to prevent that action? Because I believe it's not an infringement. I leave this open to you.